Ladies, gentlemen, boys, girls, people of all ages, how are you guys doing? My name is Blocks, and welcome to my Too Many Items tutorial for 1.8 non-forge version for your Windows computer. So, first thing you're going to need is you're going to need a thing called Notepad in WinRAR. For a substitute of WinRAR, you could use also 7-Zip. However, I'm not going to tell you how to get these because... I actually don't know if they're free or not. I have it when it was free, but you're just gonna have to Google it. Google is your best friend in this situation. Now, before we actually get started, I wanna let you guys know that if throughout this video, something seems a little weird or doesn't seem right or you're not following it, please rewatch that section. Or if anything else fails, please comment down in the description and I'll try to help as much as possible. Though I did not make this mod, I highly recommend also Googling your problem if anything, but ready if you're ready then let's begin so the first thing you're going to want to do is go down into the description below and click on the link and it will be 1.8 download right here non forge version the very one down here after the bug fix so you're going to click on that bad boy click on it and you're going to come up to this ad fly now right here you're not going to want to click on anything Discover which actually usually get a massive uh oh amount. we have a talk message let's pause that okay so up in the top right corner it says skip ad what you're gonna want to do is click that skip ad and you're gonna also want to make sure that you do not have ad blocker accessed otherwise this will not pop up or not show up so you're gonna want to click skip ad and then it's gonna download and for me it's gonna pop up right here now that next problem next step you can drag this to your desktop like I have done and then you can actually exit out of your ad fly and you are ready for the next thing so the next thing that you can do is open up your Minecraft and this may take a little bit just because my Minecraft is completely and unfunctional however it's going to work okay so your Minecraft is now open and the first thing you're gonna want to do is go down to the bottom left and click edit profile then in the middle of the screen go to open game directory and wait for that to load here in the middle you're gonna find this folder called versions click on that and then at the very bottom or close to the bottom you're gonna find 1.8 now you have two options one you can make a duplicate file and then if you don't want 1.8 in the end you can actually just delete this file or if you want it and you know you want it you can just do it right to this file the 1.8 however for the sake of this video we are going to do a separate copy so we're gonna right click go copy then right click again and go paste so now we have this 1.8 dash copy so we're gonna right click on that and go rename and we're gonna just delete this all the way up to the 1.8 then you're gonna type underscore TMI so that's too many items you can actually name this whatever you like but for the easiest route and the less complicated I highly recommend going underscore TMI so once you've got that done you can click on that and you can make sure that you are exited out of your Minecraft so we're gonna go exit and exit okay so now you have a WinRAR or a .jar file and a .json file. You're going to want to make sure that the top one, the .jar file, is open with your 7-zip or your WinRAR. By doing that, you can go right-click, uh, open with, and then choose WinRAR. Because it might actually be open with Java, and you don't want that. You want to make sure it's open with WinRAR Archiver for the sake of this. And then the .json file, you're going to want to right-click and go open with right click open with and then choose notepad as it's gonna say right here so see keep using notepad so we are actually gonna open up or first thing you're gonna want to do is right click on it and go edit or rename and then click in between the 1.8 and the dot JSON so right there and you're gonna type underscore TMI TMI there we go just like the one we did before and then you're gonna do the exact same thing to the top version so rename click between the 1.8 and the dot jar type underscore TMI and hit enter so now both of these should be the exact same except for the dot jar and the dot JSON and you're gonna open up the bottom one so that's gonna be the JSON file and it's gonna open up in your notepad now you might be worried because all of this text don't actually worry about any of this the only thing you're gonna to want to worry about is up in the top the top left it says 1.8 in the quotations and right before that last quotation you're gonna type underscore TMI TMI 
and that's actually it. You're not going to have to worry about anything else, so don't bother with any of this. And you're just going to go File, Save. And you can exit out of that. Now, the next thing you're going to want to do is open up your 1.8 TMI.jar. And you're going to want to open up your too many items that you downloaded. So you're going to have both of these files open. And I'm going to set them right next to each other. And what you're going to want to do is on the too many items one that you downloaded, you're going to go Command A, Command or Alt A. Oh, shoot. Sorry about that. Not You're going to go File, Select All, or Control A. So those are your options. Then you're going to drag all of those onto your 1.8 too many items. So drag those, and then you're going to click OK, because this is just going to make sure that the name and parameters are all the same. You're going to click OK and wait the two seconds for them to all switch over. Now you can exit out of your too many items on the right-hand side. And on the left-hand side, you have all your files in here. Now there's one last thing you're going to want to do on here is under this meta inf, you're actually going to want to highlight that and just click on it once and click delete on your keyboard and click yes delete. Now what you're doing is meta inf doesn't allow you to mod Minecraft and so deleting that allows you to make changes to the Minecraft game. So once you're done with that you can exit out of both of these windows and go back to opening up your Minecraft. Okay, so your Minecraft is now open and the next thing you're going to want to do is go to a new profile. Here, you're going to name it whatever you like. So, for instance, we're going to go 1.8 underscore TMI, but you're going to name this whatever you want. So, you can name it Minecraft 1.8 Too Many Items, anything you want. This is just going to clarify so that you know when you want to use 1.8, you just go to this version. Then, in the middle, in the lower, it says Use Versions. You're going to click on the Use Versions and go to Release 1.8 underscore TMI and click on that and go Save Profile. So now you're going to go to the bottom left and click on choose your profile and go to 1.8 underscore TMI and click play. So now it's going to download all of your all of the items that we used for the too many items and it's going to open up your Minecraft and put it all into a little file. And now your Minecraft is going to open up hopefully in a little second it will. Okay, so your Minecraft is open, like we said, and to make sure that this is actually 1.8 with too many items, we are going to go through and make sure. So you're gonna, we're going to click single player, create new world, new world, and we're going to wait for it. Now, right now, I want to state that Minecraft too many items does not work for multiplayer. I want to make sure and get that clear now. Too many items does not work for multiplayer because that's cheating and the creators and just they didn't want that to happen so I'm just gonna state that off now that it does not work so once your Minecraft is all loaded you're actually gonna it's, it's a little slow right now just because it's a new world for me and my computer is a little bit poopy but you're gonna click on your inventory button for me it's E and you can see that too many items is actually all downloaded so here are your blocks and you have a bunch of other features like your your controls, your customs, your saves, your my items. This is actually the new 1.8 uh, for too many items. So it's all new. There's no more like before it used to be over here and down here. This is actually all completely new. But this is all going to be just brand new for you. But we just took a screenshot there. But now you have too many items. So I just wanted to make sure that you guys now have it. And hopefully it worked for you guys. If it did not, please comment down in the description, or not the description, but the comments, and let me know, and I will try to help you out as much as possible. If all else fails, I highly recommend Googling it, because they are going to make it easier for you and know a lot better than I will. But thank you guys for watching. Now, if for some reason you have one error um, where it's like this, make sure to click the O button, and that's going to vanish it. So if you ever want to vanish it or show it, you just click the O button. Or, to just double check, we're going to go Options, and then we're going to go to Controls, and then under here, it's going to say O for too many items, or to open it, and there you go. So, you're going to want to make sure that your button is there. Okay, so hopefully that helps you as much as possible. If it did not, please let me know what I could do different in the, co in the comments below, and I will try to help you as much as possible. So thank you guys again. Click that like button if you enjoyed it and it worked. And share it if you want to be with everyone else and tell them about it. And as always, please, everybody, make sure to wash your hands. Bye now.